Alright, what's up guys? Heady Games Boy here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get Assassin's Creed for Black Flag for free. Um, this tutorial includes uTorrent and Damien Tools Lite. The following links you'll need are going to be in the description. Uh, it's going to be the uTorrent, or the uh, torrent link to the Pirate Bay. uTorrent itself, so you can get the game. And Damien Tools Lite, so you can install it. So let's go ahead and install those two programs, and then once you've done that, go ahead and let press get this torrent this little magnet link right here and once you've done that you're gonna go ahead and let it download it in uTorrent which will take a bit it took me um, eight hours almost nine but that's okay um, it's a really big file and I don't think there's that many cedars yet um, I believe it will get many cedars which then will be much much faster for everyone else that downloads it so make sure you after it's done downloading let it seed for a bit and then it'll be much faster for everyone else so it's helping the community Alright, moving on, once you have this downloaded, go ahead and double click it and it brings up this little file. And you can go ahead and minimize your uTorrent. And you, it has this ISO file, and you're going to go ahead and double click it and mount it into Damien Tools Lite. <clears throat> now, once you've done this, you can go ahead and bring up that same folder and go to here, or go to your PC, and then just double click this and it'll automatically run the setup. Support the software if you like this game, buy it. Okay, so it also has music, but you can stop it, which is amazing. Which hey, it's just awesome. Okay, run go just go through the simple setup. Make sure it's in your program files x86. So you remember where you installed it, and it's easy to find. Press next. Um, you can do whatever you want here. I'm just gonna go ahead and create a desktop icon, install, and once this is finished, guys, I will come back to you. Alright guys, once the uh, installation is finished, you can go ahead and press finish. Um, mine automatically close for me. Um, if it does that for you, it's our, it's fine, don't worry. Once it does that, it is completely installed. And you can go ahead and open this. Just go to your uh, PC and right click and open. And go to this folder that says crack. And then highlight all of this. And then just gonna go ahead and copy it, and then go to your C drive, program files x86, uh, Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag, and just paste. And you do this for okay. Oh, I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. Okay. Okay. Um. Yes, you want to replace the file as in the destination. You do this for all current items. Continue. So do that. All right. Come on now. Don't be scared. All right, it's coming out of its hole. There we go. Uh, restart later. Trojan detected. That's a lie. Stupid fucking antivirus. Restart later. Okay, um, don't worry guys, there's no fucking virus in this, I swear. Um, I would never send a, uh, a virus out to the public, never. Um, just because that, I, I'm just not the type of person, I wouldn't do that, and it's just overall a dick move. Okay, what you want to do is go ahead and go to the thing, the icon, not to say the thing, the icon that says Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag SP, well, it's all abbreviated. SP stands for single player and that's probably all you can do on Assassin's Creed Black Flag but you could probably find a um, crack server maybe if you get lucky so what you want to go ahead and do is highlight the icon like just by clicking on it and go to your properties and then go to the compatibility uh, run this for whatever operating system you have mine is Windows 8 so I'm go ahead and do that and run this program as an administrator click apply and okay now you have done everything and you can go ahead and rename this if you want I'm going to uh, screw AC black flag there we go so there you go and now I'm gonna switch over to show you guys the gameplay alright guys um, I unfortunately could not get in um, any gameplay for you guys which I just hate doing my uh, PC had a couple of issues I even plucked up the installation I tried uninstalling and reinstalling, but 
that's only because I messed up a part. Um, if you follow the steps exactly like I did, nothing should go wrong for you. Um, basically, I fucked it up. I basically have to reset my computer for it to even work. I'm not going to do that. Um, just letting you guys know that it does work and that I fucked up on my end and that everything works perfectly. Everything should work perfectly and smoothly for you guys. Um, if it doesn't, please let me know. I'll answer your questions as, as fast as I can when I have time. Uh, that's it, and thanks for watching, guys. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.